Today's video might not be that exciting, but to be honest, I love doing storage spaces. You can make such a big difference with some paint and organization. Most people don't really care about these tiny spaces, and that's why sometimes they are in a very bad state. So when my friend and her boyfriend moved to this apartment, this tiny storage closet that's by the front door, by the way, looked quite bad, as you can see. The walls were dirty, which I couldn't even clean properly, and there was no hardwood flooring, only concrete floor, so that needed to be changed. After I cleaned the space really well, I filled in the gaps around the baseboard first, and there were some cracks on the top too. I removed the old screws and wall plugs and filled in the holes. I removed the shelves and then I started painting the baseboard, the ceiling and the door with steam by Benjamin Moore. This is the color I used in their bedroom too and will use in the other spaces as well. Just because this is a tiny storage space, it doesn't mean it has to be plain and neutral. You can make it nice and fun. Feel free to use colors on the walls. You guys know that I always like to use what I have and I still have some leftover paint. I used this color when I repainted the wall in my room. It's called Peach Blossom by Benjamin Moore. Although I mixed it with some samples that I had to get a more peachy color because it was quite pinkish. I only put the top shelf back because she wanted to have a clothing rod in the space, but I still kept the side pieces that were holding the second shelf in case they ever changed their minds. And to be honest, they were nailed into the wall so badly, I couldn't even move them. So this was my first time putting down proper hardwood flooring and actually it was good that I did it in a small space so I was able to practice it. And even if it didn't turn out perfect, no one would tell since it's such a tiny space. As you can see there was no flooring, only concrete which was not perfectly level. I laid down these underlays which are needed to be used. To be honest, I just watched some YouTube videos on how to lay down hardwood flooring. I'm definitely not an expert, so I suggest you do that too before starting it. To hide the gaps, I added shoe moldings using my nail gun. It instantly made the space finished and so much nicer. I didn't really add any decor, I will let them decide what they want to store in here. So the space looked pretty bad, dirty walls, no flooring. To be honest, I wouldn't even want to keep my things in a space like this, but I managed to make it nice, so now it can be used properly. I 
I hope you guys got inspired too to redo your small storage spaces. Don't forget about them. They are just as important than other rooms in the house.